All right, who are you? Oh, sorry about that. Thomas Huffman, Camus Sherwin-Williams. All right, tell me your Sherwin story. I was a painter for three years in college, and my girlfriend went to the University of Idaho right across the other side of the border. Um, she worked in the Career Center, and her job was to find internships for people. She told me about the one at Sherwin-Williams, and I applied, and I got it. From there, I went on part-time to finish school, and then after that went MTP. Then I was assistant manager at Andreessen, and now I am managing the Camus Sherwin-Williams. All right, tell me about the first mess you made or gallon you spilled, whatever, whatever you got for me. Okay, this is a good one. We had one more gallon of duration. I forget what it was, but it was the last gallon of duration. Customer needed it. I dropped it off the top shelf on its top corner and it dented the whole top into it. So I thought, you know, I'll get a five gallon stir stick, open the lid and then try to like press the dent out because you couldn't close the lid after it was tinted. And I'm sitting there with a five gallon stir stick trying to press the dent out on my body and the stir stick broke and the gallon went like from top to bottom, face, jacket, clothes. And I told, you know, Blake at the time, I was like, hey, I'm leaving. And I clocked out and went home and it was a great time. Yeah. All right, how do you want to be remembered as Sherwin-Williams? Um, as just a really strict and to the point manager, no smiles, no fun. Um, no, I'm just sure, but on a real note, fun manager, you remember me, you like working with me, no matter what store I go to, I want you to enjoy the presence of me working with you. And um, that's how I want to be remembered. All right, in the two years you've been with Sherwin, what has made you want to stay? I would say mostly the people. Um, every store that I've gone to, I've made different friends and built different relationships. I love like the camaraderie of the workplace, um, not only within our store, but every store. Um, also, just you know the opportunities that they give you, there's a real chance to move up, they treat you well. Um, yeah, so I would say just mostly just the people. What are some of your interests outside of work? Um, so I like to think I'm a pretty big nerd. After I started getting my first adult money, after I graduated, I got really into Legos and Star Wars, like nerdy as it gets. Um, you know, let's do a little tour. I just brought in some of the simple ones. You know, we got Baby Yoda, the Gauntlet, you know, we got some Luke Skywalker. Um, you know, we got the succulent Lego set down here. So, much more. What is your most memorable moment at Sherwin so far? I would say last year we did the christmas photo at andreessen um it was like blake uh shockley nick lawford cameron sissel milan um johnny it was just so fun we all dressed up super like i wore a full santa outfit we all went to the store did this super goofy photo and then like shared it with everyone it was that was probably my best experience that was really fun who would you say your mentor is at sherwin williams and what have they done to impact you the most so I can't say one person. I have to say my top two mentors, Blake Shockley, Mike Lopez, awesome dudes, great teachers, good hearts. I want to give spe special recognition though to Kevin Wolf and Nick Lawford and Cameron Sissel because they all like helped me a ton growing when I first started at the company. But I would say like Blake and um, Mike, those were my go-to. I can call them any time of the day with a question and they have an answer for me and they'd help me with anything. So I would say that they are. And finally, as a new store manager, what would be your message to everybody on uh, on this side of the river in Vancouver? Um, my big message would be just to get to know people within the company, not just your store. Like, get out and get to go visit another store. Maybe if you have the opportunity, go work at Commercial or East or Salmon Creek. I was up in Seattle this weekend in Shoreline, and I was right next to a Sherwin. I literally just went in there just to say, hey. I work in Vancouver. I just want to introduce myself and see your store. It's just really important to have that kind of like face to a name thing. And you know, that relationship with all these other stores, we're all a big team, not to sound cheesy, but yeah.